Yeah, I had to DQ. It was actually <laughs> my stick disconnected. <laughs> it was such a brutal beatdown. You <laughs> let him take the W. Th this is a nice alternate timeline we got going on yeah. here. All right. Anyway, we got my game dragon and Black Star. I right. so I'm very well aware of what Akuma's tools are, but I need to ask, what? Does the Akuma Blanca matchup look like? <laughs> is that a matchup? Is that real? It's <laughs> one that is going to tilt Mikey till the end of time. <laughs> Actually, the Akuma anything matchup can tilt anybody to the end of time. That's the nature of Akuma. He's always been the and the like, Blanca anything matchup can tilt anything. Uh, the character's it's it, he's always just been such an odd character, regardless of you know Street Fighter Five. He's just it's Let's Blanca Bring historically the Blanca weird. Uh, even if he isn't looking like an Olympic mascot. Oh yes. Who bought that on my console? <laughs> <laughs> your, your money was well spent. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Proceeds to unlink PayPal account. <laughs> Listen, Muppet Street Fighter V is going to be a great spinoff. So here we are. Now, from what I, what I can presume from the character's tools, my guess is Akuma is able to win the spacing game. He, he has a solid fireball. He's got plenty of ways to find himself getting in. He doesn't have too much in the way of, like, a get out of here option. Well, he, does, he has a few options, but uh, a lot of what he needs requires meter. Oh, he went for the grab and it didn't work out. Yeah, no, it's a lot of this is going to be like my green dragon is going to press a lot of buttons and find himself in on Black Star. He's being very brave with those Blanca balls. <laughs> Ooh, that was a lot of meter for no, no like end result. I'm actually very impressed with how few buttons Black Star is pressing right now. His yeah. patience has improved immensely over the past year and a half. Nice. And just like that, my game dragon gets blown up for pressing a lot of buttons. Well, as Blanca players do. Like, th this man is very familiar with his fight stick. I'm just going for the cross up, didn't work out. And he's, he's just trying to get in there right now, and he's successfully doing it. And he's going to blow up my game dragon at the, at the current. Oh, but then he turns it around. Wake up, DP. Wake up Blanca Ball, I mean. Basically. <laughs> He's got his reversal options where he needs them, but I, it's it's Blanca, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's it's a rough. It's a rough. This is just a rough life. Okay. Like Blanca came here to have a good time. Nakua stole his money, hopes, and dreams all at once. <laughs> Left him with nothing. <laughs> They're going right back into it. No need to change anything that's on the board. I like the idea of what my game dragon's going for, where he's trying to threaten space with Blanca's tools. Because, like, if it does manage to check Black Star, he is going to get, like, decent enough in. And being as this is Akuma we're talking about, the damage output is going to be noteworthy enough. But, like, Black Star, young as he may be, is becoming a seasoned player, and he knows when to just hold back and wait for the opportunity to punish instead of trying to challenge things. Yeah. Especially against a character as proactive as Blanca, where you know he's going to be trying to do things all the time. For sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. <clears throat> all right, so we got the stream managing King Frank on deck now. It'd be like that. It'd be like that, indeed. All right, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful match from 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 my game dragon. Now this is sort of what I was talking about earlier, where like Blanca finds his way in. And he's saying in, mm -hmm. like, like he's gonna be in there for a while. He's paying rent. Yeah, he's he's the character that gets in people's heads really easily. And the fact that like Akuma just naturally has low health, like my game dragon needs to just keep the heat up on him, and it will pay off as we saw in that round one. However, 
this is an option that Akuma has that Blanca does not have the luxury of, and that is a fireball game. <laughs> Absolutely. Or an existent stun meter. Oh, Lord. Here we go. Just get it done. I'm going for the DP to finish it out. So we got the last the last round of this. It's set point for Black Star. But I'd like to hope my game dragon could turn it around. That'd, that'd be really cool to see for all the Blanca brethren out there. I think it'd be cool to see just because so the Black Star would never hear the end of it. Oh, yeah. All right, going for the throw, going for the lightning. He's in there, but now he's out there. I don't like this. Yeah, because none of that really connected, he wasn't able to to extend the Blanca The Blanca ball pushed him, like, way too far, for sure. All right, so he's really... They're both up. Oh, here we go. Hongo, give me sauce. See ya. And there it go. Hongo gave him sauce. That's what he sounds like when he said, does that super. <laughs> Hongo, give me sauce. See ya. All right, so what do we have next? Axelrod and EX Plague. Oh, this will be a good match. 